Well, studies show 1 to 2 percent of the population has something called vitiligo, including celebrities like model Winnie Harlow and Michael Jackson. Well, now a series of photos from a local photographer is shining a spotlight on this autoimmune disease. As Maury Glover showed, uh, shows us, the effects of vitiligo are more than skin deep. I love showing beauty in the unusual. As a professional photographer, let's have you drop your hands. Sherilyn Hagen is used to bringing her subject's inner beauty to the surface. All right, so turn. Now she's helping people who have vitiligo see themselves in a different light. I've seen a lot of vitiligo photo shoots out there, but nothing that was using black lights. I want this to make the people who are in the pictures to feel empowered and to feel beautiful. After Hagen was diagnosed with the disease where her immune system attacks her pigment cells back in 2016, she started using her photography skills to document the changes her body was going through using a black light. Hagen says the ultraviolet light helped illuminate the evolving white blotches on her skin in areas she couldn't see with her naked eye. A lot of people who have vitiligo will tell you that they avoid black lights because it just the spots just really pop, adds a lot of contrast. When Hagen joined the vitiligo support community Minnesota Vit Friends, she decided to take black light pictures of other members as well. Some will be on display in a special photo exhibit at Southdale next month called I Can Tell to raise awareness about the disease and Minnesota hosting the World Vitiligo Day Conference in June. We've heard that so many times that it doesn't affect people of light skin. It's, oh, it's a black disease, and it, and it really isn't. It affects everybody. A lot of people, they don't see it. They can't tell, and we can tell. Hagen hopes the photos offer a different perspective of vitiligo and bring the effects of the disease on the people who have it to light. You may not see it, we may hide it with makeup or clothing or things like that, but we see it every day, every morning, every you know night. It's it's there for us. In Minneapolis, Maury Glover, Fox 9. Very powerful, those images, mm -hmm. and really brings awareness it to does. the disease. So important for the mm -hmm. rest of us to understand what it is. So yeah. Yeah, great job. Yeah.